Dan Slada. My name is Richard, and I'm one of the co-founders of Tensor. Today, we have some exciting announcements to share with you about the Tensor ecosystem. So for those who don't know, Tensor is the leading NFT marketplace on Solana. To date, we've done over $2 billion of volume on our platform. And fun fact, Tensor is actually the number one marketplace across all of crypto in terms of the amount of royalties we've distributed back to our creators. So today, I'm proud to announce that true to our original vision of creating an open NFT ecosystem, Tensor is now fully open source. We have open sourced all five of the protocols that power the Tensor ecosystem. It includes the NFT marketplace, the NFT AMM, price lock, as well as escrow and whitelist. We call this the open NFT finance layer. These contracts have been two times audited by top security firms, Ottersec and Neodyme. And the other thing is, not only did we spend a lot of time open sourcing these repos, we've actually spent a lot of time making sure that they're great resources for you to look at when it comes to Solana development. So we support, we supported both uh, V2 Web3.js as well as auto-generated SDKs using the Shank and OB3 works. So first of all, these protocols are truly and fully permissionless, which means you don't have to talk to us at all and you can start integrating on top of these protocols immediately. We have included both JavaScript and Rust SDKs for you to integrate seamlessly. The second big thing is that we are hosting a free and fully spec'd out Web2 API. So in theory, you could clone our entire front end in a single day, and I would invite you to do that. And the final big thing, and I want to emph emphasize this um, quite a bit, is that we have completely changed up the business model for NFT marketplaces. There is now a 50-50 fee split. 50% of all fees go to the Tensor Foundation Treasury, and 50% of all the other fees go directly to you, the dev. So whether you're building a gaming marketplace, a Discord bot, or a Blink, 50% of all fees go back to you. So some of your favorite dApps, like Drip and Dialect, and some of your favorite wallets, like Backpack and Snowflare, have already integrated Tensor as a first-class citizen. So what exactly can you build on top of Tensor? Well, the first category are vertical marketplaces. So a marketplace for perhaps your in-game assets, or a marketplace for tokenized collectibles, like sneakers or Pokemon cards. The second category might be advanced trading platforms. So you might be interested in building a collateralized NFT lending protocol directly integrated into our marketplace, or perhaps Telegram and Discord bots to make trading NFTs from the chat a breeze. Third categories are for our DGENs. So we like to see maybe a pump.fund for NFTs or chance-based NFT games. And of course, we're open to all of your ideas. So please come to us with them and we'll try to support you. The second big announcement I would like to share is that Tensor Foundation has officially opened up their grant program. So if you would like to receive a TNSR grant for anything that you're building on top of our protocols, please visit tensor.foundation and apply for a grant today. Now, I wanna call out this tweet that Tolly made a few months back. And he said, I quote, holy cow, Tensor's just two devs. I'd like to argue that the next Tensor is also just two devs, and they're actually sitting in this room right now. So, I'd like to invite all of you to check out our SDKs, our APIs, and come build the next Tensor on top of Tensor. Before I wrap up, there's just one more thing I wanna say. So we're the Tensor team, and we just don't stop shipping there. There's a new product we've been working on in the past few months. We can't share it just yet. But if you'd like to be one of the first ones to try out this new product, go to vector.fun today and join the waitlist. Thanks for listening.